Hallo, ich bin Jens Bermann von Spirit Events. Ich organisiere Kongresse in München und in Basel. In München wird der Kongress vom 19. bis... Ach, Quatsch. Again. Again. Okay. Hallo, ich bin Jens Bermann von Spirit Events. Ich veranstalte vom 12. bis 14. September in München Again. Ich bin Jens Bermann von Spirit Events. Vom 12. bis 14. September wird in München ein spiritueller Kongress stattfinden. Und vom 19. bis 21. September wird in Basel ein spiritueller Kongress stattfinden. Es geht darum, mentale Gesundheit zu erlangen. Es geht darum, wieder zu sich selbst zu finden. Hallo. Ich bin Jens Bermann von Spirit Events. Vom 12. bis 14. September wird in München ein spiritueller Kongress stattfinden. Und vom 19. bis 21. September wird in Basel ein spiritueller Kongress stattfinden. Es geht darum, mentale Gesundheit zu erlangen. Es geht darum, wieder zu sich selbst zu finden. Und es geht darum, wieder auf den richtigen Weg zu kommen. Hierzu habe ich auch Referenten aus Amerika eingeladen. From the Secret, Morris Goodman und seine Frau Casey Goodman. Morris, könnt ihr ein bisschen was zu eurem Vortrag sagen? Thank you. Uh, I'm Morris Goodman from the Secret. And I'm Kathy Goodman from the Secret. And we just got some real exciting news for you. We're going to be over here in Germany, in Munich, and in Basel in September, and you don't want to miss this event. This is going to be an event that will change your life. If you've looked at the secret before, you come and listen to us and we're going to teach you the secret behind the secret. If you've been working hard, we're going to show you how to work smart. You know, there's a formula for success and failure. Everybody can do the things that I've done in life. You might look at the secret and say, look what that man did. That's impossible to do. I can't do that. Yes, you can. Everybody can do what I did. Everybody can do what I continue to do in life every day. See, that's a formula for success. That's a formula for failure. We're going to show you that formula. See, everybody in America, everybody in Germany, everybody in Switzerland, everybody in the world can build an atomic bomb if you have two things. If they have the raw materials and the formula. Everybody out there looking at this has the raw materials to do what I did. You're in better health than I am. You don't have the physical challenges I have. You have the raw materials. You just don't have the formula. You come to... Munich, and you come to Boston, we're going to teach you the formula. See, you might say, well, you know, it takes some of my time. I've got to spend time to come. I've got to spend money to come. That's a very minor investment. See, there's two things you have to look at when you're considering something like this. You have to look at the cost value and the use value. Use value is what I get out of something. Cost value is what I pay for something. If you pay, if you spend a couple of hundred dollars, and some of your time to come to a seminar like this. And you turn around and from the information you learn at the seminar, you make 10,000, 20,000, 50,000, 100,000 more yours. Who got the better bargain? You are the people putting on the seminar. So you come to this event, don't dare miss it, no matter what's going on in your life, no matter what things that are happening, no matter what you have to do, you put all that aside, you come to this event. And we're gonna show you how to change your life we're going to show you how to reach your dreams. We're going to show you how to reach your goals. We're going to show you how to accomplish things you never believed that you could accomplish before. You've been to all the seminars before in the past. You've been to goal setting seminars. You've set New Year's resolutions and nothing's happened. You come to this seminar and I promise you when you leave here, we're going to show you how to make things happen. And next year you're going to be way, way, way further ahead than you are this year. Don't dare miss this event. My work is to give happy session for all the people in the world who have do something on its own individual case. And the same in all the country and uh, I am happy I'm happy to meet in the world all these persons who have
going its own way, like level of something. So this is the only one in GTD. And master for intuition in individual intelligence. Yeah. In the last 30 years, my research. And the question can they ask the most of my friends is what is um, where is the the point between thought and soul? Okay, between uh, thinking and soul, but I don't understand. Who has the power on the first time? Thinking, who, is, who takes decisions in life on the first time? Is the thinking or the soul? I, I think I don't think you can separate. I think one goes along with the other. I don't think no matter how much you think of something, if you don't feel it in here, you can't do it. You can't accomplish it. And if you feel something in here, and you don't think it up here, then you still can't accomplish it. See, things are never good or bad out there. They're good or bad right here, and they're good or bad right here. And if they're bad here and they're bad here, they're going to be bad out there. If they're good here and they're good here, they're going to be good out there. Yeah. That's, that's really true. You know, uh, Jesus said, people ask, what is truth? And Jesus said, my word is truth. You know, once you get the word of God, the spirit of God inside you, then everything else around you becomes truth. Uh, when God created people, he made man out of clay in the ground. That we were made from a substance. But the part of us that's God, like God blew into us, a living, breathing soul, in Hebrew it's called nephesh. That's the part of us that's God, like. And that's our soul or our spirit, which you can't see. That has to come from within. That has to be, it's either there or it's not there. That's something you can't put on, you can't fake, you can't put on a pink smile. You can't say fake words. It's either there or it's not there. You know when you talk to people, and you say, I didn't like that person. For some reason, they, they smiled at you. Everything was fine, but for some reason, that little inner voice, you didn't, just didn't, you, know, you didn't feel comfortable. Or you meet someone you fall in love for the first time. What happened? Well, they, they say that when I talk to you, that I'm not really making sounds. You think I'm, what I'm doing is vibrating air. And your ear has a uh, intercostal membrane that picks up the vibration and converts it to a message that sends it to your brain. Well, I can't prove it, but I think we also have an intercostal membrane in our mind that picks up messages from people. That's like that sixth sense. For some reason, we didn't trust that person. We didn't like that person. That's your spirit, and that comes through. And if my spirit is bad, then everything I say, everything I do, is going to be bad, and you'll pick it up. So I don't think you can separate the two. I hope you understood that. I don't speak German, but... Thank you. No, no. I'm very happy. It's very good. Very good. 